Hey everybody, this is Jim, the Tabletop Engineer, and welcome to a new playthrough video. Today I am playing Legendary Encounters, the Alien version. This is my third attempt at the second game called Hadley's Hope. Um, <laughs> I'm going to try one more time. If I can't, I'm going to move on to the third scenario. But uh, once again, I'm playing the Gunner and the Medic. I've already shuffled all of the, uh, all of the decks. So I'm just going to shuffle my personal cards here and we'll get going. I'm using the red die to help me track whose turn it is, whether it's the gunner or the medic. And let's see, I'm going to start with, we'll start with the gunner. Um, and I need to reveal the top five cards for HQ. They're all around us. Get him to medical. Ripley enraged. Critical analysis, and she's here as a consultant. So really only two that help me with damage. So we'll have to see how this goes. All right, so uh, first in turn order, you always place a card from the hive into here. Uh, it costs four to scan this one. And I draw six cards, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see what we got. And put my phone over here. Uh, grunt, specialist, grunt, grunt, special. Three and three. So, meh, not the greatest, but uh, this one costs five, definitely out of my price range. That one's five out of my price range. So, um, I do. Once per turn, if the med lab is clear, you may heal a strike. That's not a bad one, um, but this one I get plus two buy power and it's vigilant, meaning when I play the card it stays out until I want it. Um, I really want my gunner doing damaged cards, but unfortunately I just don't have anything. So I will buy this one. Once this turn, if the med lab is cleared, you may heal a strike from any player. The reason is if I pull it, I might choose to clear the med lab because I'll have the, the gunner typically can do more damage. So maybe this will come in handy. So I will buy that with that. And then I refill it. Oh, same one. With the three grunts, I cannot scan this. So it's kind of a waste. That's a bummer. Can't do anything with it. So these go in here and that is the end of the gunner's turn. All right, uh, that was the action phase during the strike phase. If anything is in the combat zone, it would attack me. There's nothing here. So we do the cleanup, which is where I draw six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I know I don't have any coordinate cards, so the gunner will not be able to assist the medic. Coordinate cards are where if another player has a coordinate card, they can contribute to the other player um, they refill their deck with one card, and it's a good way to give, give assistance. But right now, starting this early in the game, I haven't got any coordinate cards. So, uh, we're going to go to the gunner. This shifts down. We draw that, or put that there. And the medic, uh, I already shuffled, but I'll go ahead and do it again. The medic will draw six. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, let's see what we got here. Specialist, 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 two grunt. Well, the two grunt, again, won't be able to help me scan, so these are sort of wasted. The four purchase, uh, I will go ahead and get, let's get this two, and I have two left, because I might reveal a two. There we go. And with the other two, I'll buy body armor. And that is the, um, man, all these are expensive. Five, six, five. I can't get them right now. Uh, that is it for the medic's turn. Nothing in the strike zone, so draw six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I know I don't have any coordinate. I just, as a habit, I check. I don't. So no help from the, the medic. It is now the gunner's turn. These shift down. Oh, man. I haven't scanned anything or fought anything yet. And it is now the gunner's turn. So, unfortunately, I have four specialists and only one grunt. Let's rock. It says draw a card. You get plus combat equal to the current. So, it's plus. this gives me plus one. So, I have two fight. Let's draw this last card, which is a grunt. So, I do have three fight. 
So I tell you what I'll do. I'm gonna re I'm gonna reveal this one. It's an event. All right. Let's see what it is. Um, the first event because I'm on objective number one, says low visibility. Attach the event to the room it was revealed in. Uh, it costs twice as much to scan that room, so it costs six now. When this objective is completed, discard this. Okay. Well, so this one costs six now. All right, and with my four purchase, I will buy... If I buy a sergeant for three, I only have one left. But if I buy one of these three, I only have one left. So there's no twos here. So the question is, you may discard a card from your hand if you do draw two. That's not bad. Let's do that one for three, and one will get wasted. All right, so reveal another one, close encounter. All right, and that is it for the gunner. Uh, nothing in the combat zone, so we draw back up. Unfortunately, I'm out of cards, so I have to shuffle and draw my next six. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't think I bought any coordinates. I do not, so no help from the gunner. Medic's turn. This shifts down. This shifts down. Place this here. And let's see. Specialist, specialist. The Battlefield Medicine allows me to draw another card, which is another specialist, and it says you may heal a strike. Well, nobody's injured, so that's gonna go away. And I've got three grunts and three specialists. Well, I can't scan this for three, but I can scan this one. So with this three, I will flip this one. It is a colony, colonist host with one damage. Uh, it does not move or strike. That's the one that I have to, I have to kill three of these. So with the remaining three purchase, I will buy this, the Vigilant. And I get to reveal one, critical analysis. You may discard two. I already got one of those somewhere. That is the end of the Medic's turn. Uh, nothing in the combat zone, so it is now time to shuffle and draw six. Man, I bought a lot of cards. Somehow the medic always ends up with a lot of cards. All right, let's see, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. How did I end up with so many cards? That can't be right. I must have some of, I must have put some of one grunt, two, three, four, five, how do I not have six? One. All right, so this was the discard, and this was his draw. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. You only do have five grunts, so that's right. All right, and specialists, I have one, two, and I better have five in this hand. I do not, so I must have put some of the specialist cards from the med into the medics deck over here, so let me do that. Let me pull out... Let me pull out some. I'm supposed, to have, I'm supposed to have seven. One, two. One, two. So I need five. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And that means, yeah. So that's what I... I was wondering why the medic deck was so thick. All right. So I did play those last time because this was his draw pile. So let me shuffle these again since, to be fair, since I had too many uh, specialists in there. And I'll draw again. All right, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do I have any coordinate? Probably not. No, I do not. All right, so no help from the medic. All right, so it now comes down to the gunner. This shifts, this, sh uh, this does not move. This jumps, and this gets put here. All right, now it is the gunner's turn. Well, I've got get him to med. Once this turn of the med lab is clear, it is not, but this doesn't really help me. But it does give me two purchase. And I've got four grunt, one, two, three, four, and another specialist. I'm going to take one of the grunts and kill this. So that's gone. And then the other three, I will scan here for two. And I got any, I got a hazard. Uh oh. The hazard for this, for hazard one, what are we supposed to use? Harsh language. Each other player discards, discards all characters in their hand that have a printed damage of one or higher. 
Well, that means I'm getting rid of all of these. Oh, and they only have three cards. Not good. All right. Well, one of the hazards, there are three hazards in this deck. Are there six? I can't remember. I can't remember. There's two per, two per, uh, two per uh, objective or one. I think there's two. All right. So I only have one grunt left. I can't do anything with it. So that goes over here leaving me with three purchase, which I will take the critical analysis. Why am I not buying sergeants? Because I'm trying to get through this deck to get good cards like that one. Um, this may come back to bite me though, because the sergeant deck is where you get bonus money for purchasing. So, and they're, and they are coordinate, meaning you can help another player. All right, so that is the end of the gunner's turn. Um, nothing in the combat zone, so we draw six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do I have a coordinate? Of course not. And uh, it now moves over to the medic. This does not move. This shifts. This comes here, and we take our three cards. <laughs> we have body armor. Uh, should you be required to draw a strike, you may discard it to avoid this. And I've got three purchase power. This one says once this turn, once once this turn, if the med lab is cleared, you may heal a strike. It is clear, but nobody's taking any damage. But with a three purchase, I can't buy anything, so I will get a sergeant. So that is it for the medic. The medic does have body armor out. It's vigilant, so it stays out. Nothing in the combat zone, so I draw six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Any coordinates? I don't think I've bought any. Nope. All right, so no help from the medic. Comes over to the gunner. Everything shifts. And let's take a look. I've got five specialists and one stinking grunt. This grunt can do nothing because this is a scan two. So this goes over here. And with the five, I can at least purchase one of these. This one and this one is good. You get plus one fight for every other green character you played this turn. But it gives me three fight. I'm going to buy this one. This one's a good one. All right. So that is the end of the gunner's turn. Seven. Oh, man. No low cost cards here. Um... That is it for the gunner. Uh, nothing in the combat zone, so we draw six. One, two, three. I'm going to have to shuffle. And maybe I can pull out some really good cards that I've drawn recently or paid for. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see what I get. No coordinate. No coordinate. All right. So nothing from the gunner. Uh, this moves over to the medic. Everything shifts. Uh-oh, I am getting ready to... One of these is going to come back down, come down to the combat zone. Uh, let's see what we got here. Um, I have Vigilant plus two cost. You may discard a card from your hand. No, I cannot because I didn't play one of these circuit symbols. So this is just two purchase power. Three, four, five. I got five purchase power. It says I may draw a card and heal a strike. I'll draw the card. I got one grunt. Check out the new RPG and Wargame newsletter. Each week, the tabletop engineer shares news, products, Kickstarters, and much more related to the gaming hobby. It's free to subscribe, so check out the link in the video description below to sign up. Which can't do anything. So this one's going to come down here. But I do have five purchase seven if i use this draw a card vigilant discard this to get plus one star for each specialist and plus one fight for each grunt you play this turn oh nice so when you play it you get to draw a card and then it stays vigilant i'm going to take this one and i'll have to use the money that i spent okay that was it for the Medic's turn. Haven't had to use the body armor yet. Uh, draw set six. I've got three, so I have to shuffle. And... Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see what we got. 
no coordinate. So nothing there to help. Comes over to the gunner. Uh, this one shifts down. Everything shifts. And uh, this gets revealed. It is a colony host. Uh, it does not move or strike, so it stays there. So let's see. I've got a specialist, 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 a grunt. Let's rock. Draw a card. I've got another specialist, and you get plus fight equal to the current objective. I'm in objective one, so I've got two fight. So I could reveal that one. This one says you may, I can't discard a card, so it's just two purchase. All right, so let's do this. With the two, this one's coming down no matter what. So with the two fight, I will kill this, and that leaves me with one, which I can't do anything with, so these go away. And all I've got is one, two, three, four, five, six. Six purchase power. So I can buy this one, which says coordinate. If you coordinate this with another player, that player gets three fight instead of three purchase. Nice. All right, so that goes here. That is the end of the gunner turn. I draw six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't think I have any coordinates. I do not. And that is it for it. Now it's the medic's turn. This shifts down. Everything's shifting. Uh, let's reveal this. Xeno Swarmer. When revealed, add a hive card. So that forces this down. Everything shifts. And now we reveal this. Another meddlesome Xenomorph. On death, you may scan any room. Four health, two health. All right. Um, let's see. It is now the medic's turn. Now the medic has body armor, so I can avoid one strike from these two strikes that are coming. Let's see. Grunt. She's here as a consultant. Specialist. Draw a card. Uh, nothing. And uh, you may heal with strike, so nothing there. So unfortunately, I am going to end up taking a strike because I only have one grunt so I can't even kill one of these but I do have one two three four five and with this I would have seven but I do have five I could buy that one that one I could buy any of these actually once this turn you may scan the airlock or ventilation shafts uh, two fight two fight during this turn, the next time you fight an enemy in the combat, it gets minus two fight. Nice. During this turn, the next... Ah, uh, Vigilant. Discard to get two. That costs three. All right, hold on. I have one, two, three, four, five. With this, I have seven. So I could buy a four and a three. I will buy the three to see what gets revealed. And I will buy this for four and that is it for the for the medic all right all right not too bad all right so now it is the combat zone so the first one you always strike from the right to the left so this one will strike and I have to use this I can use it either one doesn't matter you discard to avoid a strike so I will to to you should you be required to draw a strike you discard this to avoid it so I will avoid this one and then this one will strike and I get four damage when you draw this any other player may show a red to cancel it and I have no red cards so unfortunately the medic takes four but I can get this is a one strike card so when I get that when I draw that card that lets me heal a strike that can go away all right end of the medic's turn draw six one two three four five six uh, I've got one coordinate. I can con I can contribute some money if I thought if the gunner needs it. This moves over. This shifts down. Oh man, there's three in here now. Ooh, okay. I'm looking for one more of the colony hosts. I've got a grunt, a grunt, a grunt. Three specialists. I am gonna can take the money. I'm gonna take the two, and I get to refill this. So with that two, three, four, five, I can buy a five card. I will buy one of these for five. 
or do I buy that for plus one damage? And I also could draw a, let's do a five. All right, so I took, I took the five with the money and that leaves me with three grunts. Um, I will, oh, I didn't reveal this. Oh, two, four, eight damage. Oh, I can only kill one of them. After this is revealed, add a, add a card. So this one comes down. Man, I'm getting swamped again. And another one. When revealed, add a hive card. Oh! <laughs> uh, oh, I didn't, I was not supposed to do that. Sorry, I didn't, I didn't look at it. I know it's a monster, but I didn't look at it. All right, so this is the one. Oh, there's the colony host that I'm supposed to kill. Okay. So, two, four, six, ten damage to, to wipe that out. I, I'm in trouble. With the three, I will kill a two and a one. Um, this is good because this objective goes away and now I'm on objective two, which is set up sentry guns in two rooms in the complex. All right. So those three went away. Unfortunately, my poor gunner is getting ready to take a lot of hits. Three, starting with this one, one strike, second one, one strike, third one, Two strikes cannot be healed. Ugh, okay. All right, well, shoot. Now it is the medic's turn, and guess what? Everything shifts again. All right, what is this? Event, all right, the event is somebody's gonna have to go out there. Choose a player to draw two strikes. Well, I will draw, I will have... <laughs> I'll have the medic. Two strikes. One for two damage. Second one, three damage. Seven, eight, nine. Oh, nine out of ten health. The, the medic is almost dead. And that was that. So these shift back over. All right, let's do this. What can the medic do? Grunt. Grunt. Draw a card. Grunt. Uh... Once this turn of the med lab is cleared, you may heal a strike. I only have two specialists. Actually, hold on. What am I doing? Did I not draw? I did not draw the six. So let's one, two, three, four. I forgot to shuffle. Because I might have a coordinate card. You never know. Let's see. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see if I have a coordinate. No, no, none. <sighs> Darn it. This is bad because the medic is going to take three strikes and she's already maxed out. Hold on. Draw a card. Vigilant. Discard this to get plus one attack for each grunt you played. I played three, so this will get me six. Six. So I will play it to kill four and two. I have nothing. Oh, hold on. Oh, the med lab's not clear. This is going to strike me and I'm going to die. All right, so I've got two, three, four, four purchase. I can buy this one. And now it comes down to this. He's got seven, ten, he's got six, three, nine. If this is uh, anything, if this is one or higher, I'm dead. I'm dead. All right, so the poor medic, one, <laughs> the poor medic's already dead. Uh, let's keep going. Maybe I can win this with just the gunner. I doubt it, but you never know. All right, so um, the poor medic is toast. And that is that. So it comes over. And now it's always going to be the gunner's turn. So let's just move everything over and see what we get. The poor gunner can't be healed now. And he's got two, three, four, four damage out of 11. And I've got my six cards. Actually, this shifts down. Let's reveal. Acid blood. On death, draw a strike. Great. Okay. 
six. Let's see, Ripley Enraged. Do I have any green cards? I do not. So it's just a three plus fight, four, four fight. That's it. Well, let's do this. Three, four. I'll kill this two. And with the remaining two, I'll reveal the med lab because if it can clear up, no, oh, I can do, I can use this card. Camouflage Xeno. When revealed, this alien cannot be fought this turn. Ugh. Okay. So, with four damage, I that's done. And I've got one, two, three, four, five purchase power. I will buy this one. And that is all I can do. Uh, so the gunner has this, the gunner needs to take a strike, one, all right, one, two, three, four, five, five damage out of 11, um, I draw my six, one, two, three, four, five, six, doesn't matter if I have any coordinates because I'm not helping anybody, uh, this shifts down. And this gets revealed. Face hugger, put it in front of you. Takes three, so I gotta kill it or it will kill me. It will implant in me. So let's see what we got. All right, let's rock, draw a card. All right, draw a specialist. Grunt, grunt. Now this is good. If you coordinate this with another player, I don't have another player, so this is a waste. Well, it's three, four, five purchase. Five purchase, and this gives me, once this turn, you may scan the airlock or ventilation shafts. Let's scan this one. It's an event. And the event, remember, for this one is choose a player to draw two strikes. Well, one, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight out of 11. And another one, if this is a three, I'm dead. It's a one. The next player draws a strike. So I'm, there is no next player. So, all right. Oh, man. One, two, three, four, five, eight, nine. Nine out of 11. This game's not looking good. All right. So I did scan it, and it gives me two damage. So two, three, four equal to the current objective, which is two. So that's six damage, which I can kill this. <sighs> no, I gotta kill the face hugger, excuse me, three. I gotta kill the face hugger for three, and that leaves me with three. I'll kill this one. All right, which leaves this in, the, in there, which is not good. And I've got five, three, four, five, yeah, five purchase. We'll do this one. All right. And that is it for that round. Draw six. Oh, no. Strike. And I'm dead. <laughs> Five, six, nine, ten, eleven, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen out of eleven, and the gunner dies. Bump, bump, bump. Well. I'm done with Hadley's Hope. I will make a note to come back and play it again at some point in time, but next week I'm going to move on to Aliens 3 uh, at Fury, Fury Station or Furina 5, something I can't remember. The one with the brothers, the, the monks, the, the prisoners. So that one should be interesting. All right, this is Jim, the Tabletop Engineer. Thanks for joining me as I tried Legendary Encounters Aliens one more time for Hadley's Hope. No such luck. I'll come back to it, I promise. But until next week when I take on Aliens 3, everybody take care.